This is the photo P demonstration in the modules. You'll uh, for the sub day, you'll have a photo P link to go to photo P.com. Just like it says right here, we're going to go to new project. We're going to type in our name, the name of the project, which is the line the unit and this is the first contact sheet line cs1 or contact sheet one if you want line contact sheet one and then your period change this to inches the background to black and we're going to go to print letter and then after that we're going to go to OK, or to Create. Now we have our field, our page to put the photos on. First off, I want you to make sure that you have your white arrow and that it says Transform Controls and Auto Select. Also, go to Edit Preferences and turn your ruler from pixels to inches. That'll make sure that everything you do will be in inches. File, open in place, and just start grabbing, uh, you know, go through, should be on your, should be on your flash drive. Go to where you have them. Okay. So I did open in file, open in place. And I'm going to, because this is horizontal, I'm going to get my arrows so that they're curved. I'm going to hold the shift button so that I have a nice, easy spin. It's quicker. Don't forget the flash, the shift. Don't forget the shift button. Okay. Okay. I can continue to hold shift. And if you notice the W, I want the W to be about two inches. Move it into place. Hit enter. File, open in place. Okay, you notice it got it went behind. Look at my layers; it is under the background. I'm gonna move it up. All right. So hold down. This is already rotated, so I'm going to. This one has an awkward black background, so it'll hide. So I want the picture itself to be roughly the same size. Okay. Hit enter. All right. Already vertical. Holding the shift button down. Right, make sure you click on the layer. There we go. All right, I'm going to put it over here. I'm going to eyeball it. It looks like it's a little bit shorter. They don't look roughly the same size. So I'm going to even them out. Shift. All right, one more time. Open in place. All right. I guess I'll keep going till I find another 
one to rotate just to show you again. Yeah, once you hit enter, you can sort of move into place. Now I go up here. They're not really even. All right. So if you want, this is such a boring video. I'm so sorry. Um, let me see. Layer. No view. That's what it is. View rulers. And then watch this. You can bring a guide down. Use your up and down arrows. And then the guide will give you a line to go off of. Holding down shift. There we go. Hit enter. I guess I'll move it to the line. Right. I didn't hold the shift that time. Control Z. Oh, wow. All right. Here I'm gonna have to do some photo things. So control minus control minus control minus. Nope. We want the, the magnifying glass. Zoom back out. All right, and then you just do that four more times. So while you're making it, save as PSD. You'll see the line right there. Once you're finished, file. Export. JPEG. Don't need to look at it. Save. Save. All right. So that's how you do this work in Photopea.